the hour absolutely necessary? It was important that I see you. We made an agreement about our meeting in unsecured environments. I took the usual precautions. I'm assuming you did too. I've been standing here for over an hour. I haven't seen a soul. I called you because you said if I ever put the pieces together that you would confirm. And have you put them together? I've met someone, I've seen something. Of course, you weren't even close. Warring aliens lighting each other on fire and other such nonsense. I was being cleverly manipulated. And what brings this new clarity? I saw an ARV running on free energy. I saw it disappear. That's what they all seem to do. But the technology exists. It's existed since Roswell, and it's been in use being used on humans in human testing, the taking of men, women, and children that's misreported as alien abductions. So you believe you have the how? Yes, and I think I know the why. Why is more complicated than you may ever know, Mr. Mulder. 60 years ago, we were warned about the military-industrial complex gathering too much power. This is old news. The countdown has begun. It began in 2012, but no one knew. Tell me something new. Alien technology being used against us, not by aliens, not with aliens but by a venal conspiracy of men against humanity. It's wasting my time. What are the tests for? You tell me, Mr. Mulder. 10 years ago, you came to me saying you couldn't take your secrets to your grave, that you couldn't live with it. A man of medicine. I didn't know how my work would be used. The lies are so great, Mr. Mulder. The truth must be unassailable. And let me tell the world. They'll make a mockery of us. And let me take that bullet. And these men are capable of that. You're nearly there. You're close. Roswell, that was a smokescreen.